Hello dear viewers, James Braithwaite here and you join me in my taxi again. I've, uh, I've done some uh, interior stuff already, I'll show you that in a moment. This is the best angle I can really give you for uh, what I'm planning to do at the minute. I've got some underguard anti-rust paint which is uh, good for the uh, sills and uh, given the bare metal underneath the uh, uh, driver's mat, you know, uh, the uh, driver's foot, well, uh, I don't want this really to become a flint stone, so uh, I'm just uh, going to give it a good uh, squirt over. Whoops. Just mask this a little bit. Okay, right. Shaky, shaky, then it will be spray, spray. Shake and back to make the black, to make the black come back. Shake and back to get the jacks in the back. The idea is you use this quite sparingly, I'd say, if you need a, a second coat. Dear viewers, I forgot that you should have uh, short control bursts with the uh, spray cam for a moment. So far, I'll leave the tape in there. There, that looks a hell of a lot better. Right, better get on and do the boot. This will be a slightly more laborious thing to do. Do 
like the Great Britain and Sperry uh, chrome lettering I've put on earlier. Yeah? Okay, right, so, uh, sorry dear viewers, you won't see, uh, the, uh, think, uh, you won't see me painting this given the angle of it, but, uh, I'll show you the state of the, uh, rust in here. It's been a bit damp, so I've dried it out, and it's time to get squirting. Okay. Okay, there we go. That's a nice uh, first coat of boots uh, of undercoat uh, of underguard done. Shouldn't uh, rust uh, now. And uh, and the driver's footwell. That's uh, that's come up uh, quite nice. Okay, I just have to do the uh, next coat when it uh, dries out. That shouldn't take more than about an hour or so. I will see you in the next one. Hello, for now.